Mitchell, this is the post-match press conference. Uh, one nil away. What does this win mean? It means a lot to Uganda Cranes. Uganda Cranes is a team uh, that is in transition. We have been 2017 and 19 on uh, Africa Cup of Nations. Then we had uh, retirement of many players, including Onyango. And as a team in transition, we have started this match with five players that have played the finals of Africa Cup of Nations under 20 in Mauritania two years ago. Uh, we had few senior players and we came here to risk uh, to play against very good experienced team. I just need to remind you, I just need to remind you that uh, your team Simba beat home and away our uh, champions, Vipers, that your team uh, Simba and Yanga last week they have won 9-0 in two matches, 180 minutes. I need to remind you also uh, that in Africa Cup of Nations qualifiers at Nambole 2018, in end of September, it was 0-0 with Manasamata being four times in front of goalkeeper. You beat us in March to qualify to AFCON 2019, 3-0. Last time you won with one ball, 1-0, one is meaning in three matches, in three matches uh, without scored goal by Uganda Cranes, it was very hard, we have uh, risked, but on the end we got everything. Because I have a tradition with you personally, 2013, for Chan we, we eliminated you, 2015 for Chan in Rwanda we eliminated you, uh, last year for Chan we eliminated you, and now we have won. I do not want uh, to change myself and my approach. I just want to say thank you to the players. I have given a diligent service to Ugandan football. Ten years of my life I have given to Ugandan football brand uh, players. And players have a bit even played for me. I believe the tactical changes that we have made on the end exactly worked with Mia and Mukwala coming. With Bayo uh, Mutiaba, 17, 18 years old boy, coming inside. Uh, and I'm very happy that one boy that practically first time started to play for national team, Mato uh, uh, Rogers, that is production of the, our Chan uh, team, has scored the goal. Mia has assisted like many times before. Uh, we are not over the moon. When it's good, you do not fly high. When it was very bad in Egypt, in neutral ground, it's very hard. It's very hard. Uh, we have not given up, we have believed, and on the end we got paid with winning three points. Now, uh, having in mind that Algeria won two matches, we are same number of goal difference and same number of points with Tanzania. Tanzania has Niger to play here. We have Algeria to play at home. I hope that our government will succeed to refurbish Nambole because it's our spiritual football home. Uh, and that in June, Uganda Cranes will play at home. Uh, it's a totally different feeling playing at your own home or playing neutral ground. Uh, hoping that uh, uh, we shall succeed in, uh, with six matches, with six matches, uh, I mean six points from two matches at stake uh, to get enough to overcome our brothers from Tanzania that are also in contention. Also, Niger is in contention because Algeria has gone, Algeria has gone with 12 points. Rest of us, we have our own league. Us, Tanzania, uh, Niger, uh, we are fighting for one place and we shall see what will be on the end. Questions to Coach Mitchell? I shall say what Questions? I have to say. Thanks, Coach.